it's been an absolute pleasure working with everybody in the 2014-2015 school year and now we have to get ready for the road ahead. So I'd like to take a couple of minutes to share with you where we're going to be from June of 2015 through October of 2015. First, I'd like to share some thoughts and opportunities for the end of this school year and through the summertime. In the survey, a few people said that they were not sure or they did not have a school technology plan. This would be a perfect opportunity to begin talking to your principal and thinking about where you are as a school with technology and where you'd like to go so that if you have some funding opportunities, you'll know right away where you'd like to use that money. I will be talking to the principals about this as well, and if you're in the process of creating one or updating one, please let me know if you need any assistance. I reserved a second floor conference room at the Archdiocese Center for five separate days in July and August. These are not in any way required, but I thought if you had somebody that you wanted to collaborate with, or if you'd like to come and meet with me over the summer, it would give us some drop-in days that I could have a space reserved. So there is a tiny URL slash 2015 Arcan Summer, and when you go to that link, you will see a form. You can share what day you're thinking about stopping by, and you can also view when other people are planning on stopping by by going to the Anora Wiki Spaces, and you'll see the drop-in link is there as well. And it could be useful to just have a space to talk, especially if your schools are maybe getting the floor polished or you don't have a convenient place to meet. I also have my calendar posted on Anora Wiki Spaces in the drop-in link. So if you don't particularly have the ability to meet on those days, but you'd still like to come in and work with me one-on-one, -on -one, just take a look at the calendar and drop me an email or give me a phone call and we can get together. Also remember that all summer long I will be keeping the K-12 arcantech.wikispaces.com Tech Learning and Opportunities page constantly refreshed and updated. And whether you're going to be the technology integrator next year or not, you're always welcome to these resources, as well as you're welcome to share these with anybody within your school. As I find new webinars, new off-site training opportunities available, I'll keep updating that throughout the summer. And also don't forget to share on our Digo Shared group. I wanted to be able to have a space where people who were not technology integrators in the 2014-15 school year could come and refresh themselves. And I also wanted a place to post some work for the road ahead. So I have a brand new website. It's a Google site and you can get to it by going to tinyurl.com slash arcanlearns. There's also a link to arcanlearns from the Ann Aura wiki space. We're all going to begin with the blogger option. We're going to be talking about blogging when we get back together again next year, and I'd like you to complete the blogger entry by September 19th, 2015, and we're gonna follow that with copyright-friendly media and I'd like you to complete that by October 19th, 2015. You do not have to touch this until September if you wish, but I thought if you had time over the summer, you might be interested in looking at these items and taking care of them in advance. Also, you might want to use this as a refresher for any of the materials we worked on this year, and feel free to share this with the people at your school as well. Perhaps they'd like to learn using these options. There are some learning opportunities you might want to take advantage of. Edmodocon is a free online conference. It will be held August 4th this year. It's an all-day event, but you can sign up and just attend for a half hour or an hour. This conference is really useful because it's teachers who use Edmodo with their students every day, and they share some of their best practices and ideas. When you sign into Edmodo, you might have noticed that there's a registration link. So just sign on to Edmodo, click on that registration link, it's free, and you can register for EdmodoCon. We've talked previously about EdCamps. On August 5th, 
in Linwood, New Jersey, which is kind of down the shore area, there's going to be a Chrome Camp, and it is based on the Ed Camp model. It's going to be about all things related to the Chrome browser, Chrome add-ons, Chromebooks, and it's a little bit different when you go to an Ed Camp. When you arrive, there's going to be no schedule posted, and as teachers come in, they'll begin looking at rooms and session times and begin offering topics that they'd like to talk about. And the topics could be a conversation about how they handle certain things in the classroom. It could be a little mini workshop on how to do something or how to use an add-on. And there may even be different discussions about how Chromebooks are and are not helpful in the classroom. So I will definitely be there. And if you want, please go to the link. It is in Symbaloo as well as on the screen. The International Society for Technology Education is going to be hosting their annual conference in Philadelphia at the end of June into July. This is a fee-based program and I'm going for the first time this year. So if you happen to be attending ISTE, let me know, drop me an email, and perhaps we can get together for a lunch or dinner meetup, whoever is from the Archdiocese of Newark. Last but not least, I've worked on setting up the schedule for next year's workshops. Now, these dates are on the calendar, but they've yet to be published. And what I've tried to do is avoid all Fridays, and I went very lightly on Mondays. Instead of having four dates or four gatherings. I'm only going to do three because I'm going to combine the Essex and Union County teachers into one workshop since they're kind of smaller. And I alternated every other month with an afternoon session and a morning session. So hopefully between those Mondays, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays, you'll be able to find a morning or afternoon session that you can attend. And it should allow you to be a little bit of flexibility so that you're not missing the same group of students every time. As I've said, I truly enjoyed getting to know everybody this year. I also really liked watching how everybody had a chance to get to know each other and come to depend on each other, whether it was conversations in person at workshops or through our Edmodo group or through our Devo shared links. And I believe that we're going to establish even more communication, collaboration, and just getting to know each other and help each other through using the R Can Learn site and the blogger. So have a wonderful summer, and I'm here if you need anything from me. Take care. Bye.